I'm the only one left. Look at me. I've got rocks and gold. No one else is here with me. I'm all alone. Come fight with me. Hello, everybody. Pelican Tacos here. Episode number one eight in the books, taking it on to Titans. And look at this crud. Uh, yeah, this is okay. Minus three, minus 11, minus eight. This dude, Vadi, totally took out my base. 100% of it, looking like he's using a go to the wipe with a couple giants in there. Here it is. So throwing in the max golems in there. Boom, with the wizards behind. Coming in with a couple giants there, going right after the defenses, which is pretty nice for uh, the golems there and the giants together. Look at all of these wall breakers. Boom, go in there. And where did they go? <laughs> what, what just happened there with the wall breakers? Uh, I'm not I'm not quite sure what happened there. Let's let's replay that. I think I don't know how many of those actually got through. So we need to fast forward here. This is going after the town hall. There's the golems again. Boom, coming after my bomb. All right, right here, right there. Pause. Okay, they're all there, and just gonna keep watching, keep watching. They bombed the one to the left there. It looks like they got a little bit to the right there, but I think that's the wizards. Crazy. That's crazy. All of those bombs could not take out the wall there. If they did, it was hardly anything because, um, yeah, the wizards were on the walls as well. Has the free spell, so that definitely hurts me. Throws it on the wizard tower, which gives you a crazy splash damage at this point, and he needs to keep his giants and golems alive. He's got three golems right there in the corner, stacking up pretty crazy now the reason why I do this little hashtag spike base I know I was talking with somebody yeah a little bit ago about how this is a spiked base and how you know two years ago it worked really really well with the wall breakers because they would go and they would target the end of the walls but that's not actually why I do it the reason why I use the spike base here on the edges is so that they would have to take time to walk around and my defenses on the inside would then be able to go after them so it actually is really good because it, it causes them to travel around my walls instead of going on the inside in that extra extra time for them to walk around my guys are getting um, taken out there taking the, or actually taking their defenses out so it's all right i think i'm going to try a couple different patterns here you guys have any recommend any base for pushing for town hall nine i've got a couple that i'm going to try here and uh, hopefully you know this is really nice because i only really lost 11 trophies even though i got 100 percent. so that was a nice 16 hour shield for me but uh, I have to break most of my shields just because I, I do, you know, at least when I'm, I'm playing on the weekends and things like that, I, I want to be able to get as much play time as possible. So I'm trying to do two six-hour sessions today. It hasn't quite happened, and I've actually done very poorly today. Um, you notice yesterday I got down to 3260s, something like that. I got all the way down to 3204 today um, just because of some miserable attacks. But there it is. Minus 8, actually, I said minus 11 earlier. Minus 8. 100% my base. So 32.22 is where I'm sitting right now. And let's look at my attacks. So I've done good in the past, oh, I don't know, three hours or so, but there was a minus 20. Just did not do well. Uh, I got a 10, a 1, a 7, but here it is, minus 18 and minus 20. So I've lost, oh, a good 40, 50 trophies today, and that has really hurt me. So just, uh, just what happens, you know. Uh, I was getting pretty rushed this morning. I felt, you know, this is Saturday morning. Felt pretty rushed. Just trying to get done, hang out with the fam, go do some fun stuff, and then uh, attack when I can. And didn't quite happen. So, really, what I'm looking for now, I need to make sure I'm, I'm eyeing the infernos as well as the wizard towers. The wizard towers on balloons is kind of a nightmare because of their splash damage, because they can take out all of those balloons. Um, but you do have to be careful. Those wizard towers can be very, very powerful. And the, the highest ones will really ravage my balloons pretty quickly. So I, I need to watch out for that. But here it is. Same kind of deal. Throwing in my lava hounds first. 
really need to be utilizing my spells better. If you guys have any input on spells, I feel like I could be using them a little bit better. I'm bringing in four rage this time instead of uh, one heal and three rage. Still have the poison for clan castle troops, but for the most part, the guys I'm attacking right now are not having clan castle troops, so I'm wondering if I should use it for haste instead. What do you guys think? Should I bring the haste? Comment below and let me know if I should be doing four rage and one haste or four rage and one poison. All right, there it is, 59%. Still tried to go in, and one of you recommended that I bring in some wall breakers for the town hall, so I'm going to try that and see what that does for me, see if that actually will be uh, of a benefit to me so uh, i'm going to train some wall breakers so i can get my heroes in there as well uh, straight into the town hall so they're not dealing with that because i don't want to bring a jump spell or anything like that so all right here is the most recent attack so there's some pretty good loot here bringing in my lava hounds down there at the bottom corner away from the queen king is down there that's okay notice the air defenses are pretty low that is very very helpful Tesla Towers are still uh, one minus max. Um, Expos are the same way. And Infernos, I believe those are max. I'm not sure. I still haven't gotten that. I know that, uh, I'm pretty sure they're at least up there. They're either two or three. So there it is. No Clan Castle troops there, which is nice. Again, so my poison spell not being utilized at this point. I'm at 50% already. I want to be able to see if I can get in there and get that Clan Castle and the Town Hall, and the Infernos, and the Expos right there in the middle. I dropped the poison on the King so they wouldn't have to deal with it, but this Inferno is a multi, so the King goes in there. Is he going after the Town, is he going after the Skeletons right now? So that was kind of a, that was annoying. All right, give her the ability, and I'm gonna be able to take out this Expo, but she goes around there to the side. No, girl, and she goes after the Dark Elixir. Dang it, if she would have gone after the Tesla first, and then the town hall, she probably would have gotten it. I don't know if it was a three space away. I think we would have been able, okay, been okay to get the town hall, but no, man. All right, so we're gonna throw in some wall breakers and uh, get it going. Let's see how much time we have left. We're at 32:22 right now. So let's train some wall breakers. We've got to throw in a couple archers in there, or one archer I think to balance it out, so we have full and max troops. And uh, once they're trained, we're back in a bit. See what we can do with these skellies. Oh my goodness, I'm so close. Look at this, dude. Man. Oh, so close. Eight trophies at least. That was so stinking close. Matty Moman from American Empire. Dude, I was so close to getting your town hall. Crazy, crazy, crazy. 3272, it has been a good afternoon. And man, I've gone up 50 trophies since the last time we talked. My Dark Elixir is getting pretty good. 76, I need 80,000 to upgrade my queen. Not sure if I'm going to do that and just leave her the way she is. I do not have enough gems to gem her for the week. I do need her. But here is a very, very good loot for the day. This one is really good. Close to a mil here with almost 5k in Dark Elixir. Look at this. Going after the maxed air defenses, the maxed archer towers, and infernos and expos. Look at those guys, they are drained. That is really, really good for me. So just to have Tesla's maxed air and maxed archers, uh, I'm okay with it. I can do it. So didn't take out as much as I would have liked. This wizard tower was hitting me. Those wizard towers with their splash damage, very, very tricky. So getting in there, so close to getting that town hall. Clan Castle's getting hit by a lava pups and I got my dragon in there. Boom. And there it is. Come on, draggy. Come on, draggy, draggy, draggy. Draggy. Yeah, this raid was really, really good. I got quite a bit. I think I get close to 700,000, something like that bring these guys over to the right. I didn't think I could get in there and get the town hall. I kind of wanted the loot at this point. I had just bought a couple walls, I believe, and there it is. Look at that one little archer. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> Getting my gold right there. Awesome. Hit those rocks, baby. Hit them. Hit them. There it is. So eight tro nine trophies, excuse me, 700k, 770. Pretty awesome. 4,700 dark elixir. That feels good. That feels real good. 
Awesome. So 3272. And let's see what other ones we had. We got a couple. We got a two star here. 19 trophy attack. This was super easy because he had his town hall out. I really like going after these ones so I can try something different. But the biggest thing you know here, his walls are really low. His wizard towers are really low. His air defenses are not maxed. His cannons are not maxed. His archer towers are not maxed. And I'm just going to continue to hit him. And we will definitely get the two star with the town hall out. And can we get 50% pretty easily? I believe we can. Was not able to do much in the middle. Notice the Inferno Tower is building. Building, building, building. So I've got to get all these buildings on the outside and around the edge. When they have a lot of buildings on the outside, it's really easy to get the 50%. So I'm going to throw these guys in the middle, see if we can get that Dark Elixir. Go after that gold as well. There it is. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Boom. Got the Inferno. That is nice. We're getting a ton of Infernos now. Should be getting that Inferno reward achievement. Pretty soon for 19 trophies. That's really good for me. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Now, for the one that we just saw at the beginning here. Eight trophies, 72%. We were so close to the town hall. Throwing in the lava hounds on the lower air defense. Getting the wizard tower, the archer tower taken care of. Look at that seeking air bomb. I always forget which one's which, but there is that Tesla right there. And that zapped quite a bit of my balloons. Not really looking forward to that. But here is Lava Hounds going around in a circle. Herb going around in a clockwise or counterclockwise motion is pretty good. It is nice when the air defenses are out there on the outside. Someone recommended that I should have my king and queen take out those air defenses when they are there. And that is something that I should look at. Boom. Can we get the air defense? We did get it, which is awesome. And here comes my king. Throwing in the wall breakers. Let's see if we can get one more in there. Are you going to go after it? Boom, there he goes. Look at the little mini dude. Boom, almost got it. Very, very close, but not enough for them to go around. And they... Oh, I should have sent the queen in later. I should have probably waited to have that queen come in. And then I would have gotten the town hall. But here it is, that minion, that one little lonely minion coming after the town hall. Dude, this is crazy. Can he get it? Well, you know he can't, but that is so close. Ah, bummer. I needed what, like maybe five more seconds, something like that. I'm not sure, but it was, it was pretty singing close. Eight trophies is what I'm sitting at right now. So 3272, pretty awesome, guys. If you want to join my clan, if you are Max Town Hall Nine or Town Hall Ten, come join the Pelican Taco Clan. We have four spots left, so if you're interested, come on over. Would love to have you. We want uh, max troops mainly for Town Hall 9 and uh, Town Hall 10. Obviously, you don't have to be a max, but that's it. And if you are not, you want to come join us, come join the Pella Fan Tacos. Just started this today, the Pella Fan Tacos. Anybody that is wants to support, hang out. I will be putting my Town Hall 7, Town Hall 2 to Titan in there as well. So come join the chat. Come join the fun with the Pella Fan Tacos. Yes. That's it. Awesome. All right. So uh, I'll be back in a bit, guys. We'll see you in just a sec. All right. So 3276 found one more. Got a minus one on defense, which is pretty nice. I love it. From Trizzy to King. Look at this. Town Hall 9. 3846. Dude, you are doing well. Trizzy. King of the dot. Loving it. This base, though. Not really sure. I mean, he's got his town hall out, but everything else looking uh, looking okay. But not a max town hall nine. He is definitely doing well. Doing well. All right. There are some of the other ones that we had. We had that eight one that we just saw. Is a five cup, which we did. And um, nothing really special about that. But let me show you. Um, guy in our clan, Brady, did really, really well. Now, he is a town hall nine. But uh, has Town Hall, Town Hall 10, excuse me, but Town Hall 9 troops has a couple extra spots. Is able to have the freeze spell, which is pretty cool. But he attacked a max Town Hall 10 with the Lava Lunian and one stars it. So this is pretty cool. Now he does the have he does have the ice spells. That's really helpful for him when he gets in there with uh, the Infernos there. But look at this. Look at this. 
doing well. Throws the freeze down on it. That Max Inferno hitting all those balloons. And can these guys come in? They're hitting the expo, hitting the cannon, but not really much else. So this is pretty cool. Able to get a one star on a Max Town Hall 10, except for the walls there. For the most part, he is maxed. Didn't have Clan Castle troops, which definitely helped him out. He's going to throw in my dragon and my loons. There it is. Boom, 50% for seven cups. That's pretty impressive, Brady. Good work. But we're sitting at 3276 for the end of episode 18. Pretty excited about this, guys. I uh, made a picture here called the Pukes. What do you guys think of the new walls? Would you like them, dislike them? Like, comment, subscribe down below. Let me know what you think, but I think we should call them the Pukes. Magmas? Nah, they're the Pukes. All right, guys, Pelican Tacos out.